Cool guys. So, basically today, I went to the barber shop. Nope. And usually I go to a black barber. That's what people call it, but it's just my barber, isn't it? But obviously my barber's been on vacation for a while now, so I've had to go to a, another barber's around my area. Mario's, in fact. And today I went to Mario's in the morning. I woke up quite early thinking, yeah, I'm going to get a trim. Like, come on, look at my hair, look at my sideburn, like, everything's grown out. I haven't had a trim in over two months. Like, we're broken up from school, we're going back to school in a couple of days, and I still haven't had a trim. I'm mad. So, I've walked into the barbershop now. Well, I kind of stumbled in because on my way into the barbershop, no one told me that there was a platform. So, I've fallen into the barbershop, but luckily there was only one person in there. And the reason why no one was in the shop is because the gay barber was in. I don't have anything against gay people or anything like that, but like there was only one person in the shop when I went in there. I knew something was wrong. The barber wasn't there. The person whose name is on the front of the shop, Mario, wasn't even in the shop. So why are you here? So I've sat down now, thinking that Mario's gonna come. So waiting now, the guy that was in the chair, I didn't mention, he was 70 years old, like he didn't even know the guy was gay. So I'm just sitting there waiting now, waiting for Mario. And Barbara finishes off with a guy, gave him a little ball trim, he went out of the shop. And then I'm sitting there, he's looking at me, and I don't know what he's doing, like he's just smiling. I'm like, what are you doing? Now, he's asked, uh, are you getting a haircut? I'm like, where's Mario? He's like, oh, he's not here today. I was like, oh, cool. And then we stared at each other for a bit, like, it was that like three seconds, actually it was more than that. It was like a good 10 seconds there. He just looked at me like this. He was just smiling, like, and I was just like, So eventually I just walked out of the shop. He was staring at me, like eye contact, physical eye contact. We were looking at each other. Like he was about to give me a haircut, so I like, go in the chair. I was like, no, I'm gonna go. Like you're intimidating me now, like why am I gonna be here? So I just walked out, stumbled again out of the shop. But I'm not gonna get my hair cut by you. Especially, it's not even that he was just gay, like you're intimidating me to make me sit in your chair like what are you gonna do to me while i'm in there so i'm gonna come back in a couple of days time see if mario's there because if he's not then i'm i'm calling the police yeah i'm calling the police to deal with that situation i'm not having to deal with that again so anyways guys that was my day like i was just telling you what i did yeah <laughs> thanks for watching remember to leave, leave a like subscribe comment what you thought and yeah follow my socials so yeah, safe. Local music. Come to the babe looking like gold made this with Kurt Angle boots on. And I don't wear the boot on. And he got normal shoes on. Get the night out with the shoe from. Get them. Tell the old Uncle John. I got flex on no one. I'm the original Don. Feeling young when I'm acting slim. Feeling young when I'm acting slim. Tell man I don't wanna go to the gym. Beat that girl with a Jimmy Jim Jim.